what's up so today i'm going to be teaching a uh, lesson 5 english teaching which is a uh, nouns gender and plural nouns and singular nouns because last time i did not do it and uh, i haven't been posting really a lot these days um now i will be posting somewhat lot a lot and i'm so sorry about that but let's get started with the video we're going to be learning is nouns gender there are four genders and those genders are masculine feminine neuter and common so nouns that refer to masculine genders are basically uh, referring to the male species and uh, nouns that refer to feminine uh, gender are, are for like female species and uh, neuter genders are the genders that refer to the inanimate objects that are not like nouns that refer to both masculine and feminine are common gender uh, i have given a ppt right here uh, first for masculine we have king boy king girl mother and bride we have common which is doctor cousin reporter we have neuter which is computer pen desk inanimate objects which are singular noun refers to place animal or thing plural now plural noun refers to more than one place animal or thing for example cats are plural cat is singular teacher is plural uh, teacher is singular teachers is plural but how are we going to form these plural nouns how are we supposed to turn uh, singular nouns into plural first of there are rules to how to form uh, the nouns if s s s c h s h x or z we can turn it into a plural noun just by by adding es to the end. second rule is if the noun ends with f or f e the f is often changed into v e s it is replaced with v e s so for example like knives wives but there are some that do not follow the rule third rule is if the noun ends with y and the letter before the y is a consonant then it to y e s but if the letter before the y is a vowel for example boys then we will just simply add f. so the next for so the next rule is if the noun ends with o we will add e s but there are still some nouns that do not follow the rule some nouns remain the same even if they are used in a plural form for example dear we just use dear for more dears you know some nouns completely change when they are pluralized for example woman woman man men child children and that's it for today's video guys i'll see you next time bye bye